these are signs of a team not ready to handle their own business. Go talk to somebody in the Patriots locker room. Talk to somebody in the Rams locker room. Talk to somebody in the Steelers locker room. Talk to somebody in a locker room that has actually won something. You know what they don't do? Worry about everybody else. That's what winners don't do. Because they've been there, and so they know if we need to get back, we have to handle what we do. What we do. The immature teams that haven't done anything always worry about what other teams are doing. They worry about what other players are doing. And that really is the sign of maturity in sports, winners in sports, champions in sports. It's certainly not beneath the Warriors to be looking at what the Rockets are doing. Certainly not beneath Michael Jordan to have looked at what the Knicks were doing or the Pistons were doing. Certainly not beneath Joe Montana to look at what the Giants were doing. But those guys on those teams don't spend the offseason talking about other teams. They just don't. Because they know it's about them. This is just the sure sign that this season for the Browns is not going to end well. It's just the sure sign. And I hate to say it because we haven't even hit week one yet. And there are really great Browns fans in a really great American sports city that really, really, really deserve a winner. They deserve a winner. Browns fans deserve a winner. And they're not going to get it this year. Watch. Now, it might start next year, the year after that. I mean, I think the Browns are ascending. And I think the Browns' long-term trajectory is very good. But I, I do not believe in this season being anything to write home about. I This feels like a 7-9, 8-8, kind of constant turmoil, never quite getting ahead of things, never quite getting a, never quite getting the stability, the sturdiness, the consistency that it takes to win at this level. I mean, I hate to say it, but the Browns have done nothing. They've done absolutely nothing. And while I applaud Baker Mayfield for creating a swagger and a juice – around that franchise, they ain't done nothing. I mean, come on. You haven't been 500 yet. Let's stop worrying about everybody else. How did they draft him? They sent me here for this reason. Blah, 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 this guy. Blah, 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 that guy. No respect here. That GM, this coach. Man, you ain't done nothing. Worry about your own kitchen. Your own Freddy Kitchens.